are you thinking to yourself, like, man, this is this is going better. This feels like 2011 again rather than 2016. No, I mean, I felt good in my last couple fights, even with Dom. I'm fighting a very tough guy. He's a, he's a world champion. The last guy I fought, he's 19 he fight 19, win streak, 19 straight, and yeah. he's a young cat, and, and I was just trying to find some openings. I really could have fought another three or four rounds to kind of find out who's the man there. But I, I don't feel like I've, I've skipped a beat, but that's kind of where I'm at. I'm, I'm not trying to do this. I'm not stopping because I can't do it. I mean, I obviously can do this. I love yeah. it. But I just feel like uh, now's the time. It's it's the right time. I've had a lot of opportunities to, to get that strap in the UFC, you know, as a world champion in the WC. And I've got the next phase of guys. We've got Cody Garbrandt coming, you know, breathing down Dom's neck. And we've got, you know, Paige Van Zandt, who's headlining big shows. And I've got a lot of irons in the fire. And I think it's just time for me to take a, you know, a, a full focus on, on whatever's next. Yeah, I got your boy Cody coming up, obviously. And how many more of these irons you got lying in the fire, man? Because uh, <laughs> you keep throwing them at me, man. How many of you guys am I going to have to keep taking out? I'll tell you, hey, we're, we're getting a great rivalry going. I mean, if we look back, I think what? When we first fought the first time, you were like 21, I was like 27. And then, you know, then it was like you were like 27 and I was 32. And then I was 37 and you're 31. Now Cody's coming in, you're 30, what, 32? 31. 31 and he's 25. I mean, this Just is good. Going. Yeah, you need, you need to start getting some of your next guys up, too. You're going to need them. I got some guys. I got some guys. <laughs> we got some guys for you at Alliance okay. to bring to the table. Like, that's for sure. All right. Uriah, final thought for me. It's very rare that a fighter gets to experience this moment and go out like this. Does this result give you even more closure, you know, as you move into this next phase? I think it does. You know, I, I'm, I'm happy to be living a life on my terms, doing the things that I love. And, um, you know, I, I, wanted, I didn't want to go out. I didn't want to peter out of this sport it's not it's not something that i want to do i very easily could continue to fight until i feel like my body's falling apart but i need my body i need my mind in the next phase of things i've got big plans and this this i, I really said in the in the in the aftermath of this fight I, I feel like i've gone through and got my phd in life and and dom i'm sure you know you've grown up a lot since through this whole process and you guys have seen you know this is something that that makes you a better person you grow and um, i'm ready to go full speed I'm, I'm the CEO of my own big company whatever that may be and in the next phase of things I'm excited for it and I'm gonna go full bore you're right I, I don't I don't have a question I want to say thank you from a wrestler for opening up the doors for more of us to come and do this sport I want to say thank you for Dominic Cruz because before you did it guys at that weight class you guys weren't making any money now these guys have a whole new avenue of revenue and a way to make a living like the rest of us, like the big guys. And it's because of guys like you. You need a star in a lower division in order to open it up to everyone else. You were that guy, Uriah. I thank you for myself as a wrestler, and I'm thanking you for Dominic Cruz <laughs> as a fighter and a competitor. You got to thank him for me, man. Well, you, I can yeah, do it myself. Well, yeah, I mean, you know, on, I'm, I'm a man here. Like you said, <laughs> we've grown up a lot. Uh, I started this thing out at 21 years old, 2007. I came in pajama pants because they were all I could afford walking in there. <laughs> Definitely couldn't afford a haircut <laughs> if you watched that. I look like Lloyd Christmas out there. but That's true. So Dominic is. I got a little <laughs> gift here for you, man. You know, just to, just to bring it up, just to keep it real. Uh -oh. I feel as like, we move I into feel the like second my face phase, it's gonna be <laughs> drawn on here. As no, we you move know, <laughs> this is the thing. It started with that, and it's not gonna end like that. You know, I would say you could write on my face, but guess what? It's not on there. So <laughs> it's just signed, man. <laughs> there it is. Your pal, your pal, uh, from right. me to you, man, and that's you know, it. Nothing, nothing crafty, nothing mean. Just oh, I laying it to that, rest. Dom. Laying it to I rest, it, Dom. That's it. Well, hey, thank you guys. I, I mean, I, I feel like I've been so blessed to be on this journey, and, and I've learned so much, and I feel like I've inspired people. I've been inspired and um, just been thinking bigger. I want to thank, you know, the, the folks at UFC, the, the new owners, the, the you know, Lorenzo and Frank and, and Dana. They've always treated me with such respect and, and, and sent me out like a champion, so I, I appreciate it. You've made so many contributions. We all thank you. We know your future is in the Hall of Fame. And if you're wondering about the poster, Dom back in the day signed on Uriah's face. This time, started didn't the we, we actually thank you for doing that because if not for that action, we wouldn't have had this great rivalry between these two great yeah, guys. I will say, hey, Dom, Dom used it. I, I used to think he was acting like a baby, but he did use it for motivation. He's doing good now. I hope he can keep his keep it all together after the fight with 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 Cody.
Yeah, so you're going to give him a party shot on the way out, okay, we'll see. <laughs> you, better get, you better get him a, a reservation at the hospital for that Man, concussion you know he's going to have after we that, We could buddy. use some, some training partners for Cody. He's been knocking everyone out. You know? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, hey, that's good, man, because he's going to be knocked out after this one. <laughs>